Okay, welcome to Cypress Sawmill. Um, the purpose of this video clip is to talk about laminated timber slabs. And the first thing is there is two different grades of uh, timber that we use for our laminated slabs. The first one is what we call a dressing grade, which is a tight knot grade. So you get to see the character of the wood, you get to see some knots and defects, and um, it just looks like real timber. The other option is clears, which is like this here, and it has no knots. So that means you might get the odd tiny little defect, but pretty much clear over the whole surface of the timber. And these ones are much more suitable for kitchen bench tops. Here, um, a good stock of 620 wide kitchen bench tops, um, both in dressing grade and clears. And if we don't have the length that you want, we'll make it to order for you. Okay, the next thing we should talk about is the thickness of the laminated slabs. We do have various thicknesses of them. Uh, this one here is 40 millimeters thick, and that's a very um, good thickness for kitchen bench tops or for table tops. Uh, there are some other options. We also do some 30 millimeter thick ones, which are more suitable for um, shelving. That's a 345 by 30, which is a really nice laminated piece of timber which is suitable for shelving. We also do some thinner ones as well, which are 19 millimeters thick. And another size that we do is a 65 millimeter thick. This slab here uh, measures 900 by 2 meters by 65 millimeters thick. And that would make a really nice um, indoor table if you wanted a dining table. They all come with a, a sanded finish. Once, once they're laminated, they go through our drum sander and they come up with quite a fine sanded finish. So the only work needed after that would be to sand it with um, very fine sandpaper with an orbital sander. Um, or you could actually oil just straight up over that. And that brings me to the different types of finishes you can use on these laminated slabs. Oil is one option, polyurethane is another option, or you could use um, what's called liquid glass, which is an epoxy resin type coating. That's very uh, thick and it gives you a lot of protection, but it's a very expensive option. But good for bar tops and um, maybe uh, kitchen bench tops but relatively expensive. If we don't have the size you want, like I said before we have a standard 620 bench top uh, sitting in stock, different lengths. If you want a different size we can easily uh, custom make things. We can make whatever width you like and virtually whatever length you want. Um, we just make them to order and that usually takes three or four days. If you're looking for something a bit more rustic um, we do one piece slabs which are just slices out of a tree and usually they're 50 millimeters thick or 75 millimeters thick and they have the nice natural edge on them. Once they're dried we put them through our drum sander and they come up a really nice um, rustic natural look like that. That one there would make a really nice bar top or small table and we've got all sorts of different sizes of those available. Talking about the shelving timber, we do laminated shelving, standard size sitting here in stock, uh, 345 by 30. Um, this came about because we got people asking for something, a, a shelf a bit wider than our standard 300, which is the widest size that we do in just a solid piece of timber. The trouble is the wider you go, the more chance of cupping with solid timber. So we've started doing a 345 by 30, which is a really nice stable option for shelving. All right, we also do um, chopping boards. If you're looking for a really uh, thick, heavy chopping board, we can do those in Macrocarpa as well. Um, lots of little laminations, so you get good stability, and you could chop that in half and make two chopping boards out of it quite easily. And the other option is um, we do have a limited amount of eucalyptus saligna, which we make in two chopping boards as well, and they make a really hard, solid chopping, quality chopping board.